All right, what's going on guys? My name is Fish and welcome back to Star Wars Knights of the Old Republic 2 The Sith Lords. Uh, so last time we had not really technical difficulties, but uh, it was uh, pretty bad thunder and lightning storm outside. So I just uh, called it a stream. Make sure I didn't like, you know, lose power or like my computer explodes into a billion billion pieces. <laughs> um, so it's just a makeup stream, just kind of having fun. Uh, so we did a, a little bit of this. Well done. There is just one last obstacle before the throne room. The beast that was used to break through the force field into the throne room. So I didn't like ahead. actually no do much of this. I literally just now has a taste for yeah, a taste of blood. human blood. Um, Ignore the beast into the throne room. The oh, I can't skip this, die. unfortunately. But um, so they're just gonna run past him. Do do do. Yeah, I can't skip this. Rip that guy got clothesline. Uh, uh, blast it all. Yeah, I wouldn't do that for you, my man. Yeah, he, well, considering he just like walked up right to it. Oh, I can actually kill it? Wow. Oh, this is a lot easier than I thought. Anyway. Hooray! <laughs> Last time I actually I used Beast Trick. Get of the gods. Clear the way to the queen. I used uh, Beast Trick. And like, it was on my side. I couldn't leave the area. I'm like, oh man. <laughs> I have to like wait for it. But of course, I didn't wait for it because I had to do all the other stuff. Okay, so Valkyrie's men have hats. That's how you know. Oh, I will absolutely use battle meditation. It's what I do. I'm a counselor. I buff people. All right, guys, do better. Oh, one goes down, two goes down, three go down. Yo, oh, man, rip all these people. Oh, hold on, wait, Kreia, heal. Thank you. Oh, wow, this went a lot faster than I thought. Aw, oh, Force Wave. Here, Vaklu. Hey, Kavar, your fight's with me, brother. So, you've come to us. I had thought coming to Doxon might cause our paths to intersect. And I see that I'm right. But it turns out you were the enemy all along. The connection between these places and you was stronger than I knew. I had heard you were working with Vaklu, but I didn't want to believe it. Why are you sided with him? Let's see. Because she isn't a traitorous hut. You follow. Wow, that was rude. Side. So how do we handle this? Don't expect me to be too forthcoming with answers. You've chosen your path. I will not help you along it. Oh man. The bond between some masters and their apprentices is well known. To that degree, I will not act as your guide anymore. If you haven't found your own enlightenment, you probably never will. You had such great potential, and it was all wasted. You think I would tell you that? I'm no fool. They're safer with the Sith hunting them down. Well, Are you done with your you're also yet? the last I'm one, tired. so. And it appears they have new blood with them. You probably want to know more about them. Where they're coming from. Yeah, sure. Who leads them? What are their weaknesses? Well, I won't tell you anything. Aw, Kavar, why you gotta be that way? Why you gotta be so rude? I hope... I hope that that isn't what set you down this path. We had reasons for our actions. But the answers you seek will only help you down the road you've chosen. I'm sorry to the Jedi, student, and friend I once knew. But I don't know who you are. Well, of course. All right. No, I won't. Well, that was rude. All right, now we fight. You may think the dark side has granted you great power, but I fight with the force as well. Let's see what you've learned. Oh, hold up. Hold up. Let me save. <laughs> Let me save before I do this. Oh, ow. Oh my gosh, she like destroys me. Oh dear, this isn't good. Awesome. Oh, 
that should grant me some really good buffs against them. There we go. Awesome. Oh, well, he's not dead yet. This is bowing before the power of Don. <laughs> oh, now they're fighting. Back, Lou Italia. Back and forth. Boy, that'd be terrible if she if he died. Like last battle, he lost. I told the other masters that our only chance to figure out what was happening to us was to find you to try to understand. Hey guys, can you keep it down in the back? We're trying to have a conversation here. Now you're no doubt seeking to destroy the Jedi. Uh, I mean, there. The remaining Jedi will gather again very soon. This, at least, you cannot prevent. Well. <laughs> Telos. But Telos was destroyed during the Jedi Civil War. I don't know what you mean. Uh-huh. Atrus? But I thought she died with the rest on Qatar. You've met other Jedi, I can tell. But you won't find me an easy opponent. I will not give you the benefit of my wisdom, Dark One. Oh man. Very well. Aha, it worked. Perhaps my knowledge will sway you from your dark designs. Oh yeah, sure. I was one of the only council members who believed in you. Part of me still does. So what do you have to say for yourself? When you stood before us in the council chamber on Coruscant, we felt something from you we'd never felt before. It was as if the Force had died within you, leaving you hollow. We live our whole lives in touch with the Force, in touch hmm. with life all around us. And you had a gift in that regard. You formed bonds so easily, and they flow deep between you and others. To see such emptiness in the Force standing before you, it's not an easy thing to face. Whatever is attacking us, it's leaving something in its wake. Something we haven't felt since you stood before us in judgment. Nice. The deaths of these Jedi, the destruction of Qatar, all of these things are leaving behind echoes. Like the one we felt from you in the council chamber. It was clear to us, to me, that we had to find you. But we couldn't call you back from exile because we didn't know where you'd gone. I know that all too well. I came here to find them, to trace them to their source. The war on Duxon and Onderon. It's not Duxon, it's Duxon. Occurred here, we're concealing them. And now ah. here you are. Here I is. You always had deep connections to the Force. But such connections can corrupt one's spirit, as has happened with you. When I first sparred with you during your training as a Padawan, I could tell that you were different, but I did not expect you to fall so far. Oh, fall? I don't know. What do you expect me to say? You defied the council, you followed Revan to war. I know why you did it, but in so doing, much more harm was done. Allegedly. All those lives during the Mandalorian Wars, and all those you served beside. Too much death leaves echoes in the Force. It is the price for having such connections. Apparently, your self-inflicted wounds would not heal. And now that they've festered, you've come looking to the Jedi for vengeance. As if we were somehow responsible for the results of your actions. Do you really think I would tell you, even if I knew? If that's why you're here, then you've come here in vain. Aw, oh, man. Cut you off from the Force. Why do you think the Council was responsible for that? Your misplaced blame explains much. But the only one responsible for your present state is you. Yes, my uh, my present state of being super awesome, maybe. When you stood before us in the council chamber on Coruscant, we felt something from you we'd never felt before. It was if the force. Had uh, I think I heard this we already. Our whole life to see such emptiness in the force. Whatever is attacked, the death. Yeah. It was clear to us, to me. It was okay. So you heard what we said. These questions I cannot answer. This is something the council must answer. Well, the council is dead. You must understand. This is hard for me, especially after all you've done. Did you know when I was training you that I considered making you my Padawan? I didn't. The demands of the Jedi Council were too great. But I considered you a friend. I even tried to convince you to become a Jedi Guardian. We could have used someone like you. Oh, nope. So I'm a counselor. That had to be Sorry, made. fam. Leave me in the next game. But I won't say anything more. That sounds like the bond that often forms between master and apprentice. But to that degree? You always did form connections to others, strong ones, even when you were a student. But what you are describing is beyond me. Of course it is. All right. I have to do this again? 
Oh man. Oh wow, that was quick. Um, okay. Rip Kavar. Ah! <laughs> Maximum force points increased. I think his remains. Oh, he's got all this stuff. He's got a crystal, a that thing. All the strength things I can give to Bayardur. Probably. Um, I don't know where they went. Your time is at an end, Talia. Your people have abandoned you, and now your life is forfeit. You would destroy everything just for your ambition, Vatlu. The Republic, Isis, everything. That is a gross simplification, Talia. Change is a painful process. A price must be paid. But Onderon will have a new destiny, one larger than you could imagine. You're getting careless, Vaklu. One more mistake, and you're the one who will pay the price. Her mastery of the blade has improved, but there is more to leadership than skill with a blade. Jedi, do you want to take care of her? Ooh! I will not forget this. Do what you will. I will not fall easily. Yeah, we'll see about that. Look. All right, fam. Alright, so we'll kill 296. How much health does this lady have? Oh my gosh, and she's hurting me. Man, she has so much health. There we go. Now she doesn't. She had and now it is done. <laughs> so much health and actually hit really hard. To ensure our future, this could not have happened without you. You will be given everything I promised you. I risked a great deal by asking for your assistance, as did you in helping. Your reward is well earned. Even if I didn't have a reputation to maintain, I'd be a fool to break those promises. I know who you are. You are the last of the Jedi, hunted by the Exchange, the Sith, and the Huts bond knows who else. They've thrown everything they have to Wait. capture and kill you, but you cannot be stopped. Uh, Anyone did you just have a voice change? Fate, it was you. After we've secured the city, and that will take time, you will always be welcome here. If the Republic hunts you down as a price of your ambition, this place will be a haven to you. No, oh, thanks. never forget what you have done this day. Build a statue for me. As do I, Jedi. As do I. Your shuttle is awaiting you. After the Civil War is taken care of, which will take time, you are welcome back. Hooray! Oh, no, oh, I can't get her. Stuff, I guess she didn't have anything good. Yeah, build a statue for me, uh, make a, uh, Cory Donde. Cory Donde. This sounds fun. Cory Donde, woo! -hoo. Anyway, let's, uh, let's get back to the moon of Duxon. All the Jedi are killed. I am now officially the last of the Jedi. Except for hey, my Jedi friends. Back together. I must hear all about your vacation in Onderon. I <laughs> see you think you're hot stuff, don't you? We should return to the Ebon Hawk now and plot our next course of action. I agree. Hey, Atten's here. Now, too bad I messed up the HK factory side quest, but 
It is what it is. Look at all the next playthrough. It might be helpful if I made some changes to my remote's maintenance laser to do spot repairs. That would be a welcome improvement. My combat effectiveness could be better sustained, providing an advantageous arrangement. And my miniature counterpart would finally be able to pull his weight. Miniature the counterpart. Mini me. Oh, Rip Verden Troyer. Right then, I'll work on it when we get back to the- We are on the Hawk. There. You should be able to do some quick fixes. You won't be able to perform serious repairs, but you should be able to patch up any broken droids. Beep boop. Vader's remote has been uh, uh, upgraded with the ability to repair other droids in the party. You know, I think it's time I gave your cutting laser a little boost. It works oh, fine now he's going to get all these boosts. But we could use your help in a firefight. The Beep. Don't worry about it. We'll make sure they keep you out of their scopes. Boop. Hey, it's something for Goto to be jealous of, right? Beep beep. Or beep beep. Think of it this way. You can keep Goto in line with it. Beep 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 beep. Cutscene. Fade to black. Biter is improved laser. Hooray. I don't understand why you won't let me take a look. Statement. I've had quite enough tampering at the hands of unskilled meatbags such as yourself. I'm not eager to submit to this treatment unskilled now meat or bags. in the future. Unskilled meatbag? I'll show you unskilled. Appeasement. I did not mean to imply that you were an unskilled meatbag, as incapable of performing rudimentary repairs as holding a hydro spanner. It is only that I am quite particular with my repairs. Perhaps, when I am more confident in your abilities, I will allow you to examine my internal components. Iridonian, if I might have a moment. What is it, Yoto? I have spent some time in the presence of your remote, and the upgrades you have performed on him are quite adequate. I am impressed with your work, though less so with your remote itself. What's wrong with my remote? <laughs> I find his use of resources, energy spent on frivolous things, to be an unsightly waste. Aww. But it is obvious you have some skill, however slight, in the upgrading of machines. I want you to provide me with similar upgrades. I should be able to do something. I will see what I can do next time I have a free moment. Hooray! So you fought against the Mandalorians in the war. I was part of all the, the side yes. cutscenes, man. I worked as a technician, though. But you fought on the front lines. To a Mandalorian, there is honor in that. I could do without your Mandalorian <laughs> honor. I saw the results of your honor, the absolute destruction. No, Beardur, you are a bad guy now. now. Mandalorians are little better than mercenary thugs, and what's honor to someone like that? All they care about are credits. If I were you, I'd pick your words more carefully. I don't need compliments from a murderer. Maybe that's what it looked like to you, but that isn't why we fought. We fought for honor and glory in the heat of battle. You did nothing but murder innocents. The Republic took us too lightly. We wanted to face the full force of their army. We had to goad them to fight. That's exactly what I'm talking about. If you ask me, you Mandalorians just got what you deserved at Malakor. Defeat is part of a warrior's life. We will recover. Stronger than before. Doesn't it even bother you that your people were almost destroyed? Or do lives have no meaning to you? People die in war. Well, I'm glad to have you guarding my back. <laughs> Fine by me. Oh, I think I lost influence in Bayardur. Probably. Oh, no. Okay, that works. Oh. Uh, my life. My life for yours. I am. Mm. I am. My life. Mm, nope, that's it. Forgive me, but before oh. you go, I must ask. I must warn you. If you weaken yourself...
Wait, no, I wasn't weakening myself for you. I'm making you better. There is more to the Sith than simply rage or slaughter. There are many kinds of hate. And all of them have the call of the dark side in them. The galaxy is filled with many such evils. And rarely have I seen anything else. I remember little of my homeworld before I entered my master's service. It is not as it was. There is little left of such memories. Or the planet itself. It is not a subject Aha! that I've spoken of. Since it's Influence success. The planet was not destroyed. It remains. It orbits. Dead in space. But nothing lives on its surface. It echoes. But there's no one left to hear it. I am not certain I did. I was there when the planet died. To see everything around you extinguished. It was as if I was blinded. It was as if the Force had been bled from the world. I imagine there are worse deaths. Worse pain. But if there are, I do not know them. I was the only living thing remaining on the planet of Qatar. And my life, my agony, was a flicker in the darkness that was the planet. All that I had been connected to had been severed. Mm. Yes, but it was not survival. I still wonder what would have happened. If I had died with the others. Oh, well, you would have been dead. Perhaps there would have been some way to hide my presence from the galaxy. If only I had not felt that pain, that loss, as strongly as I did. But it could not be done. When the life was bled from the planet, and yet somehow I remained, my master came for me. He walked upon the surface of my dead world. And there, lying in the bodies of my race, he took me for his own. And he made me see. And for the first time, I saw the galaxy. And I wished to die. To this galaxy, my world, absent the currents and spectrums of the Force, was nothing but crude matter, rock, flesh, emptiness. He showed the flickering of life on other planets. The mass of beings that swarm through the empty places of the galaxy. To see such creatures, disconnected from themselves, their world, their place in it, unable to see the currents and how they affected everything around them. He showed me to make me believe in his cause. He convinced hmm. me the galaxy, all life, must die. He fed upon its ugliness, its screaming, and in its place, he left silence. And where there was chaos, he brought stillness and order. The Jedi, the last council of the Jedi, came to our world to meet in secret. They hoped that perhaps among our people, they could achieve the clarity to see what was striking them from the darkness of the galaxy. They succeeded, but only in bringing him from the outer regions. And Qatar, with my kind, with the Jedi upon its surface, could no longer be ignored. And my people died, and the Jedi died, and there was no one left, only me. Hmm. They hoped to see the threat that had been so much going them, on, but that's good. I like this. Did. But they were unprepared for the magnitude of the threat. He cannot deny his hunger for long, and any gathering of Jedi is something he cannot long resist. And now that the Jedi are vanishing, I do not know what will happen. Perhaps he will grow strong enough to eradicate all life merely with his presence. I do not understand what you mean. Oh, of course you don't. My, my wisdom. They hope to is see off the, the charts. They've been stalking them, and they did. 
but they were unprepared for the magnitude of the threat. He cannot. Oh, hold on. I do not. I will answer. Oh, influence lost. Oh man. My life. Um, I guess that's it. In general. Traveling with the Mandalorians. Oh, Don't true. worry about me. I won't cause any problem. You're too trusting. Was this some? Oh wow. Query. Statement. Answer. Well, this is. I don't think they're helping me all that much. Um, yes. It's Very well. Oh, never mind. Yes. Very okay, yeah, you don't do anything. What is left of the Jedi has felt what has happened. The death of the last of the council. You will find what remains in the ruins of the Enclave on Dantooine. Oh, perfect. This matter has come full circle, and there is something there that you must hear if you are to understand. Oh, okay. Sounds good. What is left of the... Oh. This... Can't talk to Kriya, then. Oh, then. Yes. Oh, then. Guess we can talk to Atten. Something. All right, I'm game. What did you want to? Sh Got. Something up. Um. Yeah, that's all of them. Sounds good to me. Let's go. Back to Tatooine. I think that's where we go next. Hopefully we can find another HK unit. I'm, I'm hoping, anyway. Oh, there it goes. The game. There it goes back. That was weird. Um, so let's take... Uh, let's just add him and... What is up with this? It's like one to work. Weird. Yeah, don't get your hopes up. I'm just. Oh, he has a double lightsaber crud. Don't get your. Taking your lightsaber. Give it to Bayardir. Yes, upgrade, upgrade everything for me. Um, lightsaber. Oh, wisdom. Nice. I kind of want that. And, um, thing I had, yeah, on, on, 
you. I don't have anything. All right, I'm okay with that. All right, that will. Oh yeah, that makes red. Hmm. An item. And this lightsaber. Also restricted to light side. Uh. Um, oh yeah. So I don't even use it anyway. Let's make it more purple. I think that should be pretty good for... For him, and then he has Freedom Nod's lightsaber. Yeah, that should be pretty good. I hope. I don't know. Kind of double check every. I would need to do one more thing with ether. Let's upgrade my lightsaber. Great item. Let's save. Perfect, all the mercenaries are still here. Very good. Mercenaries just grumbles at you. I wonder if they say anything different now. Oh, there's no receptionist. Can I even get in? Oh, it's locked still. Oh man. I've got nothing more to say to you. Uh, I bet you don't. All right. Well, like no one wants to talk to me. Story of my life. So I want to find one more HK unit. I don't think I will though. That's the only problem. At least before end game stuff. Where's my level at now? Everything's so ridiculously high.
one's back. Let me look at the sea. Let me see if I can kind of find them. Yeah, it doesn't look like I can really do it. Um, let me see if I can find all of them. I heard you were responsible for driving the settlers off this rock. Thanks. Now we can salvage all we like free of Kunda's regulations and fees. I've still got some Jedi junk left to sell. You buying? Oh. All right, well, I think it's just certain. gone forever. I mean, yeah, I could get all these, but I don't really need them. You came back from the sublevels a lot. Have you come to join the others and mock my misfortune? I heard you were a s Yeah, they're they're unfortunately long gone. I want, oh, I wonder if I can like Do this. Wonder if this does anything. Look who's walked into our camp, boys. Mandalore himself has come to visit us. I am the new Mandalore. I have reclaimed Mandalore's helmet, lost after our defeat at Revan's hands. Assemble the rest of your clan. You will return to Duxon. We must come together as we were before and prepare to fight a new war. A war that will return us to glory. And if I take that helmet from you, guess that makes me the new Mandalore. I've always wanted to be called that. I know all about your exploits, Mandalore. We have fallen far in the past years, but even still, I will not stand idly while a usurper claims to be my leader. It is unfortunate that you feel that way. Perhaps I'll be able to change your mind. Stay out of this. This is my fight. Okay. Hey, oh, well, you should level up first. Uh, just keep leveling up, I guess. Guess we can do Come 
Oh, dude, you're unarmed. You're not going to do anything. Get out of here. Influence gain, Mandalore. Oh, he's like super dark. Wait, there's probably more Mandalorians, but. I mean, oh, this guy didn't even have anything good on him. Lame. Did I go everywhere? Yeah, I did. Rod. Oh well. And wow, it looks rebuilt by someone. I don't know who, but they did it. Hooray. Oh, the door opens. Perfect. Wait, so I was just on the hill hillside. Uh, so let me just save again. And rebuilt. Get an enclave. Are we gonna find someone here? I remember this from the first game. It... It is different. It has been some time. This looks like someone needs to be using a... A push mower and a weed eater. Around this place. It looks unkept. Maybe take some vines down. I wish there was an HK unit in here. <laughs> walk, 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 walk. And this is all like brand new to me. I haven't seen what happens since I killed all the Jedi Council. I've only seen what happens if you bring the ball back. Hello, everyone here? Is it as you expected? I did kill everyone. Oh, no. Yes, and that is why this place is empty. Your actions have crippled the order, perhaps destroyed them. What? No. Perhaps it is difficult to say. For every Jedi slain, for every Sith slain, another rises. But the Order is wounded, yes. Oh yes, your hate has destroyed them. You should be proud of the blood you have spilled, the lives you have ended. But before enjoying this victory, there is something we must discuss first. I have done what I can to keep you from the Jedi and the Sith, but a critical moment approaches, and what you have done is not enough. Master Vrook, despite his faults, was right to come here. I had thought he might have recognized Dantooine for what it was, what had been done there. You are tied to places such as these, you know. Yes. But Master Vrook was unwilling to see what other masters may have seen. That the echo of Dantooine he felt was inside you as well. They admitted it as much, 
in the council chamber after your trial, though they did not understand what it meant at first. Hmm. They assumed it was a threat that they felt. From one perspective, they were correct. As much as you can form connections to others, such connections exist on the galactic scale as well. It is possible to hurt or sever those connections, to create places in the Force where it is difficult to center oneself, but that is the crudest form of manipulation. It is possible to affect those connections in other ways, by the slightest action, a seemingly minor choice, a small cruelty. The stronger your connection to life, to the Force, the stronger these echoes can be made, and the stronger they are felt. When heard, Force sensitives instinctively seek out the Source, are drawn to it to try and form a connection. And when the connection is formed, both become stronger, and the influence between them grows. Your companions, many are touched by the Force on some level, and in many ways, they serve out of compulsion and because your connection influences them strongly. It was much like it was for you in the Mandalorian Wars, with many Jedi under your command. But this connection has other consequences. When the Source is wounded, the one on which others draw strength, then they are wounded as well. What one feels, the other feels. And when others die, the scream travels back to the Source. If they occur at the same time, or at the right time, these screams will build upon each other until it is the only sound you can hear, and the deaths of many will cause the screams to build until their pain becomes yours, and you die as well. And that is why, during the Mandalorian Wars, you lost your connection to the Force. It was that final battle, the deaths of so many Jedi, that caused you to lose your connection. Oh. It caused the wound that you feel now. It caused pain in the Force, an emptiness, a wound that has yet to heal. But it does not end there. If it did, then perhaps the threat that we face would be more manageable. This pain I describe, the echo of these acts, is true of planets as well. Tremendous loss of life on a planetary scale can also cast echoes, create a scream, a wound in the Force that can travel across the galaxy. It can be felt by force sensitives, and it can influence them, whether they realize it or not. If enough of these echoes are allowed to build in the force uncontrolled, the consequences could be disastrous. The disastrous. Of all life would be affected. As I have said, screams and their echoes can overlap, build in strength. And if timed correctly, they will build on each other. The scream will grow. And anything that can hear this scream shall be deafened or killed. With difficulty and controlling it. Well, I do not believe such a thing is possible once it has begun. But in order for this to work, all of them must be timed correctly, must be carefully orchestrated and controlled from the greatest to the smallest of echoes, oh. even the ones that come from a lone exile echoing across the galaxy. And when that exile forms connections to others as you do, the danger becomes apparent, the echo continues to grow, to travel. Yes, he is correct. You form such bonds easily. The why of it is not important now. All that is important is that you understand that your actions affect others strongly. Hmm. Anyone can do such things, since life is connected by the Force. Sometimes the connections are faint, but in your case, they are very strong. You instinctively know how to manipulate such connections, to influence others. You have seen it mirrored in those who travel with you. You give others strength to act, but it is also possible to draw upon the strength of others to increase your own. It is similar to drawing upon the Force, as Jedi do. But when it is touched by the power of the dark side, it is something else, something deadly. These Sith we face, they have learned how to do this. It is a technique that has been lost for some time, not seen in the day since the ancient Sith. They can use it to consume other Force sensitives, and at the highest pinnacle of power, use it to consume anything that lives. The blind seer. Her master has harnessed this technique and he is rapidly approaching the height of its power. Hmm. I fear he may even rival some of the ancient Sith. 
he is already more of a force than a living thing, a hole in the force that threatens to draw everything into it. And the teaching must die with him, or else all life will be placed in jeopardy. The destruction of the Order, the Masters, it was not an end in itself. I did not expect them to still live. Their presence was knowledge I did not possess. But now this has been corrected, and now the sides of this conflict are as I had thought them to be. There are no more unknowns. But this moment is all that really matters. It was never my wish that you find the Masters, only find yourself, although I did not expect them to still live. I had hoped you would learn something from the Jedi Masters as they fell before you. Not just of battle, but of yourself and the Force. I did. I did. They My Force points increase after everyone. I must know if killing them, if revenge brought you any measure of satisfaction, if seeing them dead has settled the disquiet within you. Because it matters to me in a way that never mattered to the Jedi, to the Council when they cast you out. You must understand, I did not wish the Jedi dead. Defeated, perhaps. I merely wished them to see that they and their teachings were wrong, that one could not truly understand the Force simply by adhering to the Jedi Code. All I have ever trained have been failures to them. Students who went to fight the Mandalorians, who fell to the dark side, who abandoned their training. To see one that had the strength to best them, that is a moment I will not forget. Yet, it has not been as satisfying as I had hoped. To best one in battle is one thing. To defeat them without striking a blow, that was my hope. Regardless, it had to be done. To have such powerful Jedi still live, still be felt in the Force, even on such worlds as they had chosen, was a threat that had to be ended. That is not important. First, let us return to my question. If, by killing these Jedi, if you achieved any measure of peace... <coughs> It was as I thought. You have failed me completely and utterly. What? I have taught you to hear the Force again, shown you the contrast, and yet still you do not understand. This is what you have wrought. Countless murderers, slayers, assassins, born of war that has, as always, taught the wrong lesson. You showed them life without the Force. And instead of showing them truth, power, all you showed them was how the galaxy may die. You are responsible for all of this. Even now, events spiral towards destruction, and there is nothing that can be done because you refuse to listen, to understand. You have seen the effects you have on those close to you, heard the echoes scream across dead planets, and watched as your strength has grown. Yet it is for nothing. To have the Jedi Masters brought low by such a failure. There is no victory in that. You have not heard a thing I have taught. And for all I have said, you have never learned to listen. Oh, nope. Oh, dear. Do you feel that exile? It cuts through your defenses as unprepared for such an attack as you are. Let that pain be a lesson and a reminder of what you have forgotten. You were my last hope. The only one who could change what is to come. And now you have left me nothing. I shall teach you no longer. Our bond remains, but that is all. This place will hide you from the Sith for a time. Enough to do what must be done. Stay here and die, apprentice. Among the wreckage of all that remains of the Jedi, it is a fitting grave. Oh, that she's the totally fine by to stabbing herself in the stomach with a lightsaber. It is done. She is no more. Take me to Atris, 
she will have the strength to do what the council cannot. Well, the council's dead. Uh oh. You have taught them to bond with others and then feed on others through that bond. What you have brought is the death of all who can feel the force. It is your gift to the galaxy, exile. And unless you hear it and silence the echo you have caused, then every living thing everywhere that is touched by the force will die. If I lose her, it will be my failing. It is the failing of the Jedi who followed Revan. It is a failing of their teaching. Soon your ship will come, my master. I will bring her before you, but I will not let you have her. Soon your ship shall come from that which made you. I know you can hear me. I have always known. It is why I followed you. I have destroyed planets for you, General. But now, this once, if we could save something in this galaxy, I need to do this, or I will die inside. Like I died at Malachor 5. Oh, man. I gotta start laying off the Joomba juice. You get a new dark side force power. Force crush. Journal entry added. Oh, man. Rogue employee. Oh, wait. All right, well, let's uh, bounce, I guess. Can I explore? Excuse me. Ooh, a foot locker that I can't open. Broken item, oh man. Actually, yeah, I can't. Red. Oh well, I'm sure it was like the greatest item in the world. And I broke it. Oops, don't mind if I do. Ah, uh, I have much. Another corpse. Oh, uh, crystal. Ooh, excuse me. Anyway, I guess let's uh, load this popsicle stand. Oh, went to the courtyard, but now I'm going to the Ebonhawk. Be like, hey. By the way, Kray is a jerk. Oh, he already knows, though. She's gone. The handmaidens came for her. They know who she is now. They'll take her to Telos, and Atris will do what she'll do with anyone she thinks is a Sith. Yeah, she will, if she can. That's what I was afraid you'd say. <laughs> <coughs> well, rip the HK side quest. Sure, it was great, but I messed it up. Oh, whale. Is something wrong? You look troubled. I can feel it. That is an odd answer. What did you mean by it? I follow you. Feel as I do because it is my choice. I believe in what we are doing, what you are doing. I am here because I choose to be. I simply do. There is nothing I can show you as proof, except give you my word. Something happened within the Enclave. What is it? Um. Let's see, what do I want to say?
Then they do not understand you. That is the danger of being a Jedi. When one separates themselves from others, chooses to lead a life of isolation, denying what makes them a feeling being, it is easy to make such judgments. And such judgments, I believe, are made in ignorance. There is no danger in what you represent, other than your humanity. You change others, but I do not believe it is due to the Force. I believe it is because you are a natural leader, and because you feel connected to the people around you. Where they look at you and see the death of the Force, I look at you and see hope for all life. And that perhaps a life lived without the Force is not the punishment it is believed to be. I will understand if you feel you must go alone, but I ask that you do not. Instead, take strength from your connections. It's like slowly to backing up. Do not forsake them, as you did in exile. There are others who need to know you. Telos needs you. The planet and all its people are in danger. If we do not stop the Sith now, then the Republic will fall. That's kind of what Admiral I want. Admiral Onassi, I have found the exile. Uh oh. And that which hunts the Jedi. The Sith will attack Telos. They believe many Jedi lie hidden on its surface. We are going there now to aid them. Mikal out. Traitor. Uh, Atris. <clears throat> Haven't seen you in a, in a hot minute. Who is there? Who I am is not the question. I am Atris, Jedi Master. The last historian of the Jedi. The last of the Jedi. Those are titles, words you cling to as the darkness falls around you. It is not the first time we have met, Atris. I was here before. With the exile? Yes, I was here both times when the exile was brought before you. Who are you? I was the one who asked her to be exiled. I did as you asked, so long ago. You, you seem familiar to me. Atris, I have always been here. You are that which has attacked the Jedi. You are Sith. Sith is a title, yes, but like you, the title is not who I am. It is not what I believe. For you, it is different. Know that there was once a Darth Treya, and that she cast aside that role, was exiled, and found a new purpose. But there must always be a Darth Treya, one that holds the knowledge of betrayal. Who has been Darth betrayed Treya. in their heart <gasps> and will betray in turn. You have bathed in the knowledge of the Sith. But there is not enough truth in such teachings. But it will be a step for you. You have gathered Sith holocrons, Sith teachings from across the galaxy. It is why you have chosen servants who cannot feel the Force. And most importantly, they cannot feel what you have become. I have sought to preserve the Jedi Order. And I have gathered all that I know of the Sith to this place. So I might find them and stop them. I had wondered if any of these holocrons had survived Dantooine. You have taken relics from one destroyed planet to the devastation of another. It was always intended for the Jedi to retreat to Telos should Dantooine be attacked, taking all their lore with them. We could not allow the tragedy of oh, to sir. happen again. Canal. Such an act one sec. marked Telos for destruction. It is why the Sith came here, though the fleet commanders did not know why. It is why Revan ordered its destruction to mark the beginning of the Jedi's civil war. It was a message that there would be no place for the Jedi to retreat, to hide. I would not be surprised if Revan left other gifts beneath the surface of the planet. Much can be buried beneath graveyards that will never be found. When the Sith attacked, that should be better. I felt Telos die. Turbo lasers fell like there lightning upon the landscape, as they did on Dantooine. And so many died. So many voices. Screaming in pain. Yes, such acts leave their mark on the galaxy. Their cries travel far, though few can hear them. How did it happen? Search your heart. It was never battle that called to you, never battle that caused you to fall. Alicor 5 has touched many things, and it casts its echoes still. Why did she betray me? You betrayed yourself. Do not blame the exile. And unlike you and I, there is still a chance that one may be saved... The one that you cast out. Where is the exile? I had thought. Oh, she will come. But it will be too late to save either of us. It is such a quiet thing to fall. 
but far more terrible. What's up with her shit. elbow? Like cuts in and like where her elbow's supposed to be. Anyway. Your mistress awaits. She has much to share with you. Okay. Oh, I'm back here. I guess I can't add. Nope, of course I'm not. All right, I guess I gotta do everything on my own. Well, if you want something done right, you gotta save the game. Man, I know that like 30 hours. Yeah, 30 hours in this game. Holy smokes, that's a long time. And, uh, oh, a lab station workbench on the other side. Let's just double check every... I don't need to learn about it. Make sure I got the best stuff I can get. Yep. My stats should be pretty good. I do want to level up. I know there's an achievement for level 30. I don't know if I'll get that. I know I missed a few side quests here and there. My four seven hundred and forty four. Oh man, alright, well. There's a whole lot of. No one here. Oh, look! A remake of the council room. Interesting. And Atris. She said you would come here to this place. If you think you can defeat me here, you are wrong. All this collected knowledge, all these teachings of combat and the Force, they're mine to command. And if I must use it to end you, I will. Surrender. You need not die. I fear nothing. Least of all you. Let us end this. Okay. Oh wow, she's like nothing. Kill me. End this. Oh dear. Ow. Oh, my ears. If you will not kill me, then what will you do? Where she walks is hidden from my eyes, but not from those of her kind. It is possible I may draw one last piece of knowledge from these holocrons. Oh, yeah. Gosh. You always okay, knew good. where they were striking from. You always knew. These Sith are spawned of you. Spawned by the Mandalorian Wars. All those deaths. All those Jedi. Their power is to feed on life. Until nothing is left except a hollow galaxy. Echoing with the screams of the Jedi lost to us. Yes. I had thought she was awaiting me at that place, but I see now that she lied. It was not meant for me, but for you. She has gone there. She is waiting for you to travel to Malachor 5 to finish what you started. Yes, you are an echo in the Force. A hollow space where it has been wounded. It takes a great act of destruction to create such emptiness. But it can be done. It creates places where the Force is difficult to hear and difficult to find one's way. And you carry it with you, always. Now she seeks to create another echo, a wound in the Force. Arsmuse, thank you for the follow. You've joined the school on Twitch. I highly appreciate it. Thank you so much. Hope you're having a great day. No life is left. You were strong enough to withstand it once, but few have your strength in such a way. Unless I like purple, it doesn't show up very well on Twitch. I do not know, but she needs you there. If you choose not to follow, 
She will murder herself at the heart of Malachor, and you will die along with her. Oh, yeah. Who is Kreia? You're important to her somehow, but I... Oh, the ugh. hissing of the foul crowds. The worst sound effect ever. Maybe not really, but... I do not know for certain. She is willing to sacrifice herself at Persuade. the of that graveyard world for you. A choice others have made in the past. A choice I wish to make. It is because I care for you. And I suspect that you alone hold that place in her heart where nothing else lives. And that is why you are the only one who can stop the destruction to come. She seeks the death of all Jedi, all Sith, and the death of the Force. It is madness. It is impossible. But she believes you are the key. There are places in the galaxy dead to the Force where nothing lives, where the Echoes travel forever and do not reach their destination. And these places may be created, even from the simplest of events, the slightest of motions. One person, hmm. at the right place, at the right time, can change the face of the galaxy, or end it. You're important to her somehow. Uh oh, I've literally heard this. She is, and that. Because the at times I wonder what we would be if the Force was taken there we from go. us. If we would truly be Jedi or Sith, or simply human. There are places in the galaxy, and oh. one person at the right. Because the Force had been stripped from her, as it had been taught. At times, I wonder what we would. Okay. That's all I have. Rip Atris. Zroom. Zroom, zroom. in my microphone. Zroom, zroom, zroom. You have done well. All is as I have foreseen. Good. There must always be a Darth Traer. And if it will not be her. Then I must assume that role, and as always, bring about the betrayal of the Jedi and the Sith. I am not here, not in the flesh, not in your mind. These holocrons hold much of the Sith, and they hold much of my teachings from long ago. But you have much yet to learn, and great tests await you, the death of the past, the death of this false Jedi was only part of it. One of the Sith Lords has come to Telos. You know why he has come here. And if he is not stopped here now, then he shall lay waste to this planet. You must confront him. He is part of the past, and like this false Jedi, must be laid to rest. Only then shall you be ready for your final test. If not, then you shall die. Oh dear. You know where the final test lies. It is not here, not in the battle that will wage across the surface and skies of this dead planet. And know that if you do not come to me, if you run from this, then I shall sacrifice myself and end both our lives through the bond we share. You know where you must travel, and there I shall be waiting for you. Okay. I at least take my lightsaber? Nope. I mean, Atrus had my lightsaber. But no, can't use it. And there's, uh, this is Master's ship. I don't think we learned his name yet. At least not like game wise. Well, no. what do we have here? I didn't believe it when Lino reported the Ebon Hawk at dock, but I guess it really has. Though given the trouble we've been having, maybe I shouldn't be surprised to see you. You look terrible. What happened to you? Some sort of plague growing around? Yeah, now's not the time to make fun of my uh, appearance. Oh, Sif people. 
You were looking for me, Gren? About time you showed up. The Sith are moving to keep us trapped in here. We need to push them back so we can get reinforcements deployed to the rest of the station. Sounds like you need someone to punch a hole for you. That's the idea, yes. All right, then. You'll have one Sith-sized hole coming up. Let's go, boys. That's the guy from uh, Dantooine, right? I'm not mistaken. Came out of nowhere. A fleet of warships dropped out of hyperspace. And before we could scramble fighters to intercept them, we were under attack. There were Sith fighters everywhere. And the few flights we sent out were barely launched when the bombardment began. We did our best, but we couldn't stop the landing craft that followed the initial wave. We couldn't hold back the Sith troops. We chose to retreat and began the evacuation instead. We were unprepared, and the docks were quickly overrun. We retreated back to the entertainment module to evacuate residents and workers. It's a good thing you got us that fuel from Slayron, because if we didn't have it, we'd probably be falling apart. Oh, you're welcome. But there's still another problem. The Citadel's no battle station. It wasn't built to withstand this sort of attack. If we can't stop the attack, we'll be going down in flames. The Sith numbers seem limitless, but we haven't lost all hope. We've heard reports that we might be receiving some assistance. A small detachment of soldiers sent by General Vaklu arrived to take the fight to the Sith. If you need to get to the Ravager, then you're going to have to fight your way to the shuttle from here to the entertainment module, then make your way to the docking shuttle. Does this mean you won't be putting us into force cages again? <laughs> I thought I saw you disembark with Beodor. Is he here? Now that you mention it, where is he? I guess it's no time to be swapping war stories anyways. Good luck. Welcome. Can I add people? Nope. Beodor's gone. Everyone's gone. Add. Sure. Actually. Maybe not her. But disciple. Because he has like all the mass. He has like all the healing stuff. That is really nice. Beats. I want to get him for. He's got Dually. He's got all this. There's a ton of uh, fighting feats. Kind of things, but. And powers. Let's see. What do I want to give him? Oh, wow. He only had one level. Oh, oh yeah, because I used him already. Alright, he's got all those really nice ones. Uh, does anyone have a workbench? Good luck, ma'am. We're counting on you. Good luck, ma'am. We're counting on you. Good luck, ma'am. We're counting on you. Good luck, ma'am. Uh, yeah, We're counting on you. All right. Well, can I get rid of Atten? Can. All right. All right, we'll use C3 as our portable workbench. Wait. 
Upgrade item. Oh, there it is. Okay, I must just missed it then. Uh, and yeah, I think we're all set. I think we all have really great configurations. I think I can do first dexterity. I feel like this might be better. Better too. Oh, he's a soldier. Yeah, interesting. All right, well, let's let's continue. Let's do this. What's up, Mandalore? I must leave you for a time to gather my Mandalorian warriors. We will rejoin you when the time comes for the assault on the Ravager. Is that your idea of a joke? Don't be a fool. I'll meet you at the shuttle. All right, peace out, Mandalore. You slowly walk away with yourself, unit. Well, boys, the TSFs are over their heads and they need us to rescue their hides. Simple enough. We just need to get out there and face down a squad of Sith soldiers. Time to earn our pay. Hey. My boys will have the way cleared for you in a moment. These TSF officers are ill-equipped to handle the threat of the Sith. It is lucky General Vaklu dispatched Oh, something's exploding. I led a moderate-sized group of shock troops who are currently making their way to the fuel containment systems. My men have run into some significant Sith. The Sith are trying to sabotage the control system to crash Citadel Station into the ground. If that happens, there won't be anything left to save. No. Oh. Well, I need to make sure they don't sabotage the... that thing. Oh, this is gonna be a cakewalk. We're all. I think, hey guys, you mind doing something? Ooh, force to wait. Oh, he's gonna die. I gotta try force rush. I can look at it from here. First crush, um... Nice. Cannot be opened. Well... 
don't really need the average frag mines, so it doesn't much matter to me. Thank goodness you're here. We just can't seem to make any progress against the Sith line. After they established their position, they brought out their turrets. They've been devastating our numbers. Oh, uh, well, that sucks. Uh, we managed to take a few out, but they just keep unloading more of them to replace the destroyed ones. It's up to you to help us throw them back. We gotta get them cleared out of here, and then we're ready for one last charge. All right. Everyone provide covering fire for the Jedi, then advance on the Sith positions. We'll be right behind you. Good luck. We are your reinforcements. Oh, is that, oh, is that the droid planet people? Yay! Oh, yeah, my droid army. I have a droid army. I forgot about that. Go, team. Oh, wait. Time out. I have a force crush. Oh, my gosh. I just destroyed that guy. I did it. We have received transmissions from the city. Understood. We will secure. Hooray. Good luck, ma'am. We're counting on you. Yeah, okay, they're all gonna say that. Um. Oh, yeah, system down. Oh, is everything locked down? It looks like it, yeah. Oh, that's battle meditation. I did it again. I mean, it doesn't do anything, but... Like, at least to my force powers. I don't... Not hurting me. Well, I'm not dead. I guess that's something. I got hit by a grenade. I, I just barely missed the whole blast. Ugh. They're, they're moving ahead towards the TSF office. It's tough going, though. The, the Sith, they seem to be everywhere. Uh, I, I won't do you any good. There's a, a piece of shrapnel. It's lodged in my gut. Uh, uh, that sounds I move, it feels not like fun. I'm being ripped open. I, I won't make it five steps. I, I'll just slow you down. Hmm. When you put it that way, I guess I've got nothing to lose. Let's go. Yay. Ah, uh, no dark side points for that? Oh man. these people. Ah, uh, Cantina's not open. Oh. You guys just want to come in here and like try to be heroes? Sith heroes? Well, it ain't going to work. There's a workbench. I'm going to say that uh, one guy did not make it. Can I go this way? We will join oh. you in the assault. Peace, rank, and fight. Let we Mandalorian, Kelborn, Zuka. You will not face this alone. So cold. Oh, wait. I'm not ready. I'm gonna go this way first. This area is secure. 
This area is secure. We can take it from here. Yo, yeah, this area is secure, my butt. Is that what I needed to do? I complete it? Oh, oh that was easy. Okay, what remains? A oh, blade lightsaber. Nice. Alright, well, anyway, real quick, I'm gonna save. And I'm gonna run to uh, the bathroom. Uh, very quickly, so I'll be right back. See, that wasn't too long. Oh, seriously, I need a better chair. Anyway, where are we at? 27 levels? I think there's an achievement for 30. I sh might be able to get there now, I guess. We still got a good amount of, uh, It's him! Sir, Sith warship dead ahead of us. It's attacking Citadel Station. Let's close the trap. Concentrate all fire on the warship and deploy red and blue wings to engage enemy fighters. Sir, at this distance, our weapons will barely scratch it. We can't hope to match its firepower, but we need to draw it away from Telos. Sir, if it keeps firing on Citadel Station, the station won't be able to maintain its orbit. I am aware of the situation, Lieutenant. I do not intend to lose Telos twice. And I know that ship. It was a Malachor 5. It's me! I'm in the little teeny tiny ship. Boom, boom. Oh. Oh, okay. I thought that was gonna be a crash landing. I thought that was gonna be really bad. Seriously, where's Beardur? Like, he's left. Gone forever. Who's gonna walk out that door? Is it us? Huh? Oh, oh dear. <laughs> It's the Mandalorians! No, the blue one died! Rip blue Mandalorian. <laughs> Mandalorian is so awesome. suffered extensive structural damage but its particle fields still maintain a minimal atmosphere within the ship and our cargo it's being brought aboard soon teams will be dispatched to the target sites do the republic forces suspect no mandalore the proton cores do not emit a signature the republic ships can detect if they do pick up the signal they will assume it to be emanating from the ship's missile bays did you get
get an ID signature on this vessel. You were right about the vessel, Mandalore. It is of Malachor. It still bears the wounds of Mandalorian guns. Then let's finish this. And remind the galaxy of Malachor V. What was that about? Nothing you need to worry about, Sith. You are coming with me. Don't get all sentimental. <laughs> I just don't trust you to get the job done. Been waiting for this for ten years. It's just time to do things the old-fashioned way. I know what it meant for you to accompany me here. Candorus of Clan Orb. <gasps> trust honors me. If you betray me or my men, I will kill It's true, it is Candorus the same. from the first game. <gasps> I mean, obviously it is. Oh, oh, do I have to have them? I do. Oh, man. Fine. Level up. And what's his face at least to give back? He has like all the dark side powers. Um, I don't want to give her light side powers. Like, can she have a better? Nope. Oh man, literally every. Aim. Yeah, well, I guess that's it. Oh, hi guys. No, oh, hold on. Cancel. Start with these guys. Uh, Base King Louie, no, I am playing this on Steam. Oh, wow, they are hurting me a lot. Um... I might need to make the level a little bit easier. Oh, this is so much fun. All right, come on. You need to heal yourself. I shall make this one see. Yeah, he's dead. To battle. Rip that guy. Yeah. My life is yours. I don't think anyone can. Yeah. Lame. No one can open that. We'll just bash it open with a lightsaber. Probably get broken part, yeah. Oh well. Probably the second best part ever in the game. 
but it is what it is. Oh yeah, sure. I can do that. And seven Bodiana, hi, how are you doing? Hope you're having a great day. Mandalore. We are holding our position, but the Sith appear to be offering little resistance. It's like they don't even realize we're here. Alright, two fifty XP, don't mind if I do. Weakness is revealed. Sounds good. Oh, look at all these people. Oh, rip. I leveled up. Oh, okay. Oh man, sorry about your uh your main account, man. Well, you're back in control, so that's good. Yeah, getting hacked is a terrible thing. Ooh, attributes. No, I didn't find any more, um, what's it called? I didn't find any more HK-50 squads to attack. There were no more. So unfortunately, it looks like I missed in this in this playthrough. It is what it is. Yeah, but it doesn't, you know. What was that? Force shield. Oh, ugh. no, thank you. Yeah, I mean, unfortunately, there wasn't, but again, there's not really, not really anything I can do. I'll get on the next playthrough, uh, whatever that is. I don't know when, but I definitely played the game of, uh, at some point again, do a light side playthrough of this, a dark side playthrough of KOTOR 1. Oh, that's a door I can't go in. That's a door I can't go in. There's so many doors. Hey guys. And now my uh, my friends leveled up. All right, have fun with your pizza. Eat a couple slices for me. I'll see you. Uh, I'll see you when you join again, unless you're still here. want to give her and keep doing force strain Let's see what's behind door number two. A large locker. A life support pack. That'll be good. 
And a room with nothing. You've reached one of the targets. Oh, nice. Arming signal received. Two more sites are left. We've lost contact with two of our. Uh, um, site one. That's where he came in, right? Yeah. Try this. Now he's working for us. Nice. Okay, this isn't another one. Look at the stance here. Oh my gosh. Remains. The pizza is pretty good. Can't I can't argue with Oh, look at all these people. There we go. Any uh, nice stuff in here? And a couple of doors, some remains. Oh wow, they are generous with the life support packs. They are super generous. in here this looks like fun nope literally nothing oh wait ooh, the locker oh the bash it open unfortunately hey more left support packs can't complain anything good in here another door i assume somewhere Hi guys. Time to die. Let's see how many we can you are no just destroy. There we go. Nice before he woke up. Oh, uh, yeah, I don't want to go to the bridge yet. At least I assume so, huh? Oh, this was her room, I think. This door leads to my cell. Or cell. I had forgotten. If there is time, I would like to center myself. There is a meditation chamber within my cell that I would visit one last time. Sure. You do your thing. <laughs> Past the surface, there is the force. 
Although you better meditate quickly because we don't have a ton of time. Where once there was a world that was strong in the force, now there is a barren wasteland. From the death of an entire world comes great power. My hands shall be hate, my eyes revenge. Oh dear. <laughs> you shall be avenged, and the one who has done this shall die. I like her people? Going right. More for me here. Yeah, I'm good. Now that we have the stock. Oh. Yay! Yay, Vista has chosen to embrace the vengeance of the, of the dark side. Ha 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 ha. Oh, she's like slowly making her way. Anything good in your chambers? Excuse me. I guess I can't feel the presence of the dark side here. Oh well. Security door, don't mind if I do. Do not mind if I do. Couple large lockers. And a bed, and a sink. A space sink. You've reached one of the targets. Good. Put it down. Oh, there's Mandalore making his way Arming downtown. This doesn't look good. Oh, oh dear. Oh, what he had- was that? I told you to wait. Mandalore, we have made contact with the enemy. And one of the cores has detonated prematurely. Was it in the target zone? No, Mandalore. We have failed you. I offer you my- Do we have another core? No, Mandalore. Even with the other two cores set in the ship, it will not be sufficient to destroy the vessel. We need to find another proton core, or we need to make one. All right, wait for my signal. This isn't over. And don't kill yourself before I tell you. <laughs> don't kill your... Uh, what do I need to do? Oh. Dark Nihilus. All right, so that's his actual name. Need to build another core out of God knows what. That was where I just was. Nice. Oh, Colonel Tobin. Have you come to kill me? You Jedi are masters of cruelty. Letting me take I don't remember you being here. Only to die here. Far from Onderon. He happened. The hunger that fills this vessel. It is power that it consumes without end. It is that power we feel. Oh, wow. Mm -hmm. You look like me. Felt. It was an echo too strong to ignore. There is nothing to be done except wait. If you go to him, he will destroy you. And your last moments shall be of shadow and pain. Um, that one. Onderon, but Yay! There's no longer any need. You are right. As long as he exists, Onderon is in danger. The galaxy is in danger. What would you have me do? Um. That one. I'll report to the target site, Colonel. I let Colonel. my men know you're coming. And if you try anything stupid, they'll shoot you dead. I will do as you ask, for Onderon's sake. Hooray! Such acts have their own strength about them. Oh. I had forgotten. Uh, 
Um, oh, perfect. Hooray! Um, excuse me. Man, they are super generous with these life support packs. This is where I just came from. Um, I assume that's where the last one needs to go, but. Have I been everywhere on the ship I have? Except there. Yeah, so maybe if I go there? Maintenance area? Wrong way. Wonder if, uh... I wonder if that'll do anything. If not, I might just have to go fight Darth Nihilus first. Maybe it's in the secret room. Oh man. Alright. Use Force Storm. Knock people to death. Hey, yeah, okay, nothing here. Where do I need to go? Let's see. Oh, perfect. Hooray! I did a thing. I need to go back over there. I can finally confront Darth Nihilus. Let's get over here. You've reached one. All right. Arming signal received, Mandalore. That's the last of the men. Ray. All right, so I need to remember how to get back. <laughs> Thirty-nine. Of those things it's like over here if I'm not mistaken oh it's in the back right yeah they could have went oh well it is what it is see socks it is what it is actually this seems like a great place to save Did again. Perfect. All right. Couple of remains. I've used any dueling shields this entire game, except for Paragus. Oh, Other guy. Oh, hold on.
A weakness is revealed. Well, rip all of you. Or life support packs. They are. They are preparing me. Immor built. Wait, what? Mortality belt, yeah. Oh, well, I already destroyed it, so don't need to do much of that. I guess I have to go this way. Yeah. Oh my gosh, does that do 173 damage? Force crash is legit. Oh. A weakness is revealed. Oh my gosh. This is fun. I like destroying things. You are no match for us. Alright. Uh, you guys drop anything good? No? Aw. Let's see. Large locker. Another one of those immortality belts. Oh. And large lockers I can't really do. Oh, broken item. Be a little more finesse with my uh, lightsaber. Anyway. Oh. This door leads to the bridge oh. and my former master. If you wish to gather your strength, this is the last time. Perfect. All right, so let's save. Actually, before I save. All the buffs. <laughs> I don't even know if they stack. Okay, yeah, so now I'll save. My force powers will go away. Run, 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 run. Hello. Cover character. Mandal is just like, I'm just gonna chill back here. Nope, never mind. Oh dear. Oh, he used Force Crush on me. That's my move. Oh, 
Oh, I'm no one's apprentice. Yeah, I figured, but uh, give it a good old college try. At least someone can understand this guy. Um, oh, aha. Oh, wait, time out. A weakness is revealed. Oh, he's pretty tall. Oh, I need to heal myself. There we go. To battle. Aha, halfway. Let's see what happens now. Oh. Sure, that seems like an evil thing to do. Aha! Oh, he's stunned. Dark side points, hooray! Aha! Yeah, rip visa. <laughs> was was it enough? I I did not want to leave this life yet. It was weakness. But for you Oh, gosh. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, yeah, she's gone. Black screen. Remains. Hooray. <laughs> okay. All the stuff she had. Perfect. Um... All right. Well, fortunately, I can't like keep anything of his. Uh, I don't want to do battle meditation, but I'll save. And um, we'll pop out of here. Rip, uh, rip, Darth Nihilus, rip Visa, rip a lot of people, <laughs> rip this ship as soon as I'm done. You get out of here. Remember the way. Oh, that was easy. Yeah, I didn't think it was that hard. Oh, I forgot a locker.
Okay, yeah, so I guess we bounce. Okay, I want to go this way. I think. I think I want to go this way. And uh, this way. I think we can get out of here now. That's where men. Oh, step away for now. Or anything? Secret area. Nope, I can just stand the fire. That's super cool. Anyway, all right. Yeah, we're done here. I'm pretty sure. Nothing else. All right. Leave the Ravager for good. Hooray! What's up, Grant? I saved your entire place again. You should also build a statue for Admiral me. Admiral Onasi wanted to speak with you, ma'am. Oh, boy. As I understand it, there was something prior concerning a uh, mutual acquaintance, I believe is how he put it. All right. Lead on. What's up, Garth? It's a little beat up, but it's still home. I wasn't able to be here to protect it when the Sith attacked the first time. This time you gave me a second chance. I owe you. I've read your records, how the Jedi sentenced you for doing what you believed. You wandered past the Outer Rim during your exile. I ask you, did you find any trace of Revan? I served with him like you did, and we had to part ways like you did. He said that there were places where he had to walk where I could not go, places where having allies or anyone he cared about would only place them in danger. It's been four years, and I still don't know what happened to him. He told me to stay here to try to keep the Republic strong, and that he would return. It was the hardest request I ever had to follow. I don't know, but it was important to him. He said that he believed something had been behind the Mandalorian Wars. That it hadn't been the Mandalorian's choice to attack the Republic. Whatever it was, I think he went off to find it. To fight it. Hmm. It was near the end of the Jedi Civil War when it seemed like we were going to lose everything. We met on a Republic warship called the Endar Spire. Hey. We attacked over Terrace and the Sith had stormed the ship. KOTOR 1. Republic, but it was <laughs> like the war didn't end for him. He would keep remembering things that he'd done. I did save the Republic in the first, our first playthrough, so. he finally remembered something terrible that he'd done during the Mandalorian Wars. And he went to put an end to it. He left a lot of people who cared about him behind. But I think he did it because he thought it was the right thing to do. But whatever he set out to do, I, I don't think he succeeded. And here you return, with his ship, without him. Yes, wherever he went, your ship's been there. If... If you return to that place, if you find some trace of Revan, no, simply tell him that Admiral Onassi is following his orders. Okay. Goodbye, Karth. Safe journey, exile. Ah, Basila. Did she know? No, she didn't. There are times I fear we shall never know where he left Karth, and I cannot live not knowing the answer. Why he sought to protect us. He asked us to stay, to keep the Republic safe. It was important to him. There's one and more I Jedi I have to kill this Basila, even I'm though it won't let me. that there are worse things to lose in the galaxy. <laughs> well, now we're back on the, the Ebon Hawk. I 
guess we're going away. Nope, we're just on the Ebon Hawk again. And all the Jedi who followed Revan. Oh. The true Jedi died at Malakul 5. Wish I'd never met her. Wish I'd died there. That the storms had dragged me down into Malakor 5. We will not surrender. We will not die like we did on Malakor 5. Your command echoes still, General, and I obey as I did at Malakor 5. Now Malakor 5 comes to us, and I wish to face it. This last I wonder where we're going. You know where you must go. It calls to you still. It is the heartbeat of the past. And she must be stopped there, now. Or she will bring the screams of Malakor 5 to the galaxy, just as we carry the echo all this way. Oh dear, there's a lot of just junk. And there it is! Malakor 5 and all its green electricity. And she must be stopped. Oh. And she must be stopped. Hmm. Freya, you look different. And looks like you made some friends. Alright. I'll see you later. I'm actually heading off after this uh, cutscene too. So have fun. Play some rounds of CS. Gotta get ready to go back to work. Oh wow, he's here. It has been some time. You were a fool to return. I spared you once. I will not do so again. Spare me? Ah, yes. No, you simply did not learn the lesson I sought to teach. That your strength is as meaningless as the strength of my hand. Why have you returned? Because now I understand why the exile did what she did. There is much to be done. Hmm. Interesting. Oh, well, that's unfortunate. And now the rules are reversed. <laughs> master, she is here. I know. What is thy bidding, my master? You are to do nothing. When she arrives, bring her before me. She may not survive Malachor. So touching. Can it be you still have feelings within that shell? Master, what will you do to her? You know what I shall do, you who wear my teachings so well. I will break her. She is a blank slate upon which my teachings may be written, as you well know. Leave me. Await the arrival of the exile. When she comes, bring her before me. Okay. And we have crash landed on Malachor. No one can help us. This is where we end this stream. So guys, thank you so much for joining me on uh, another episode, another stream of Star Wars Knights of the Old Republic 2 The Sith Lords. I'm having so much fun. Fortunately, we missed the HK factory, but hey, it is what it is. Uh, so anyway guys, thank you so much again. If you're on Twitch, be sure to hit that follow button. Uh, if you're watching on YouTube, hit the thumbs up button, subscribe for more awesome content, and then head over to Twitch, hit that follow button. That way you get notified every single time we go live and you can join all the fun. Alright guys, I'll see you next stream and uh, maybe we'll finish this game. Alright, peace.